It's always great to see communities and ideas come together. Now, the device I'm talking about in this video is the new EV. Now, we checked them out earlier this year in Computex. This is a company that uh, reached out to the community and built the first crowdfunded PC. Yes, it's available, it's in my hand, it's not uh, vaporware, it's actually real. Now, this is an awesome story and an awesome device. What we have here is basically a community that came together and said, we wanna build a crowdfunded PC that actually gives us the things we want. We like something like the Microsoft Surface, but we want more. And they've done this, and they've done this at a affordable price range. So it starts off with a Core M processor, goes all the way to a Core i7. And that that Core i7 goes up to um, a terabyte of storage uh, with uh, 16 gigs of RAM, and you can get all that for $1,549. Yes, that's how much it costs for all that. Also comes with a combined keyboard and pen together, so you don't buy that extra, which is great what is absolutely fantastic, and we'll talk about those accessories in a second. Now, what do you have here in this device? So we know the specs. The version I have here has a Core i5 uh, mobile processor. It also has um, eight gigs of RAM and 256 gigabytes of storage SSD. Now, besides that, you've got a display that is a uh, resolution 2880 by 1920s, the sharp, gives you a display. It's a nice display, a high refresh rate on that as well. Uh, it also supports, of course, a uh, pen input, whether it be the EV pen, which comes with this, or a Microsoft uh, Surface Pen as well will actually work with this device, which is pretty nice. Now, in terms of other things you have, and especially ports, you've got two USB-A ports, so regular USB ports are there, which is great, two USB 3.0 ports. You've also got one USB-C port, and a Thunderbolt 3 port. Yes, it has four ports on a device like this. Think about it, it's portable, it's light, and you've got all those ports. Now with the Thunderbolt 3 port, this supports eGPUs, which means you can have an external GPU casing, um, whether it's something from like uh, Razer or any other company, and it will work with this device. So which means you can take this on the go, be portable, come back home, and do some serious gaming. Now we don't have an eGPU, but we promise you're gonna get one and gonna check it out with this device because I think that's an awesome idea that you can get with this. Now, you've also got a fingerprint sensor on the power button, which allows you to unlock the device with Windows Hello. It is fast, it is functional, it works out pretty well. You've got on the hardware itself, you've also got micro SD expansion, as well as also four quad speakers. The design and build is really nice. It's got this brushed uh, metallic feel of the back. Uh, you've got a five megapixel camera there and the rare two megapixel camera in the front uh, of this device. I think the overall build and look reels really solid. Now the keyboard that comes with it is a nice pogo pin uh, connected keyboard. The keys feel really comfortable, easy to use while you're typing. It's also a backlit keyboard that comes with seven colors. So it's an RGB keyboard, which is great. For a device like this, you don't expect to get an RGB keyboard. It's just a little thicker in terms of of design as opposed, opposed to something like the Surface Keyboard. Uh, overall functionality, you're getting around 10 hours of battery life. This thing just handles very well. I like that. I like the fact that um, this is something that is priced well. Um, you can also expand its functionality with an eGPU. And I think also the fact that they looked at their community to build a device like this is awesome. So that is the EV, and this is a device that I think a lot of people should definitely check out. Uh, if you want to pick one up, definitely use EV's uh, link down below. It's from their website. That's where they actually sell the device. It's a whole community. Uh, they also are having a batch sale, and I think in about 14 or 13 days. So basically, basically check that out, mark it on, so you can actually go ahead and pick up this device. I think it's a great gift for the holidays, a great gift for yourself. If you need something portable, something that can expand, and think about it. If you're one thinking of you know, doing a lot of gaming and also want something portable, this might be the option for you. The fact that you can take it on the go, enjoy some real good productivity with it, and bring it back home, and connect to the eGPU, and play a lot of games, which is great. So if you have any questions, guys, or any comments, let me know. Don't forget to like and share this video, favorite this video, subscribe to the channel, and once you do, hit the notification icon to get notified with our latest videos. This is Thunder E saying thank you, and Always enjoy your entertainment.